of sequence initial. Second umbilical tower now separating. Boosters igniting, the engines firing. Ramping up to flight speed. And liftoff. Liftoff of Tim Copra, Yuri Malenchenko, and Timothy Peak on their way to the International Space Station. So far, getting good first stage performance. The Soyuz delivering 930,000 pounds of thrust from its four boosters and single core engine. The first stage of the Soyuz, 68 feet in length, 24 feet in diameter. It's going to be burning liquid fuel for the first two minutes and six seconds of the flight. We'll be getting regular launch performance calls from the uh, engineers out there at the launch pad in Baikonur. 48 seconds and counting after launch. Everything continuing to go well with the first stage of the Soyuz rocket. Yeah, we're receiving data. Chamber pressure nominal. Thirty sixty seconds. Pitch. Now one minute and ten seconds into the flight, the Soyuz rocket already traveling at a velocity of one thousand one hundred miles per hour. On board Malenchenko, Copper and Peak. Uh, one minute and 22 seconds into their planned eight minute 45 flight into orbit. Everything continuing to go well with the first stage, the four strap on boosters and the core engine performing nominally or normally. 90 seconds, engine stable. And just there we see the four strap-on boosters jettison the first stage uh, and the boot strap-on boosters completing their job, dropping away at an altitude of 28 statute miles. At this point, the Soyuz is traveling at about 3,350 miles per hour. On board, everything continuing to go well. You can see British astronaut Tim Peake there uh, over in the right seat in the center, Soyuz Commander Yuri Malenchenko. Everything going well for the Soyuz craft as it continues its climb. The Soyuz already traveling at a speed of over 4,700 miles an hour. The thumbs up from peak there and a quick wave. The Soyuz core stage uh, continuing to perform as expected.